we are about ready to do an update on the pineapple we started two weeks ago and we're going to do a channel shout out Okay, we got us this here pineapple. I ended up putting it into some soil already. Uh, but I'm going to let you see what it looks like real quick with a little picture. What the roots looks like. Once we get this in soil, you just plant it up. So you got all the roots and everything covered. You're going to have all this. And just uh, to also add, this is two weeks out. So it actually takes between a week and a half to two weeks to start getting the roots and you will end up with a lot of almost every one of these corners has some dead ends on it. It is not going to hurt the plant to prune these back. This is what I did on my last one that's still growing strong. So uh, that's what we're going to do today. Is we're going to take all these dead little corners up around here like this one and different ones and we're just going to trim it right where the dead meets the green kind of like like that so uh, I don't know if it's really necessary but uh, it did help the last one out so and more of this will end up more of this will end up looking dead through the process and uh, I just kept trimming it out and also the main part that will die is the center part will end up dying and coming out of there eventually because that's where the new plant will start to take off so the center of this will end up either dying and coming out or you would just end up seeing new growth but all the new growth will happen in the in the middle of the plant but this is basically all we're doing right now like i said is just trimming off these little dead corners it does not hurt the plant at least it did not hurt the last one just Cut all the dead stuff till you, you uh, just get green only. You can use prunes or I'm just using regular scissors. And all of this dead stuff, if you want to just throw it in your compost, you can. There's not a whole lot of it, but I mean, it wouldn't hurt. Or you could just throw it away, whatever you want to do. Now, this plant, like I said, will end up getting more deadness to it or little ends on it. But, and it would take maybe two to three weeks to start seeing any kind of new growth it will almost be dormant for about two to three weeks and you don't think it's doing anything and then all of a sudden you'll get either the center will die out then you get the new growth or you'll just start getting new growth those are the two options there but it will take at least two or three weeks and it will look pretty much like this here pretty well be dormant uh, during that duration so if you're not seeing anything don't don't get discouraged or get worried that it's not taking because this plant is a very slow process plant that you just got to be very very patient with and uh, but it will eventually as long as you got those roots uh, when you put it in the water it will eventually take off 
Uh, just got, like I said, just got to sit back and be patient. It is a very, very slow process plant. So let me turn this camera around and let you show. Let let me show you what this looks like from a, a top view. Okay, this is what it looks like from the top now. And all I use is just a seed starter mix that you would use when you start your your uh, seeds uh, to start planting your your garden. So this is just like a regular seed starting mix. And I just added uh, rainwater to it. And, uh, and uh, that's basically it. Cut off the dead ends that you see over here. And now it's just a waiting game. Just give it food, water, plant food, different stuff. And uh, maybe some fish emotion every once in a while. I also gave mine a few times little clippings of banana leaves in the soil. It'll break down and give it nutrients. And uh, just give it uh, filtered water. It loves rainwater whenever I stake the other pineapple plant out in the rain. Uh, it's it really took to it really well so uh, other than that it's just a waiting game and then like I said this here's a very slow process plant but the plant in itself is so cool I just like growing them and then if we get a pineapple later on then that's just it's just an additive so but we're gonna flip this camera around and also get into a channel shout out I want to give a shout out to DIM Tips. Uh, he's got a really cool channel where he just loves to fix and do different stuff with all kinds of little items and give tips and tricks. He has a really good personality that shows out in his channel. I think everybody would uh, really enjoy watching his channel. He uh, also participated in the uh, Bring Back the Laughter Challenge. And I said if somebody participated, let me know that they put out a video that I will give their channel a shout out and uh, allow people to see their video or also check out their channel. His channel is a very good channel. He's been a very good supporter to mine since uh, we kind of got connected. I really like watching his content and I think you will too. So look around. Here I will end up putting a little something where you can check out his channel. Plus I will put a link in the description below just in case I burger up putting something around here. But you can go check him out wherever it lands. And you have an awesome week. Stay awesome. Stay safe. Find your start and reach your goal, and I will see you in the next video.